Hi, this is Trevor with Running Warehouse with this week's vlog. Let's check out and see what's new. First up that I'm really, really stoked about is the Neutral Energy. It has a nice one-piece booty construction with a stretch pull tab. Comes in a half ounce slide on the previous version. Zoot has, uses their Z-Bound in the forefoot and heel. Provide a nice cushioning, responsive ride, great for those midfoot strikers. They also use barefoot technology in the interior of the shoes that can be worn sockless, really comfortable, very slipper-like, and they also use the traditional laces. This is a great shoe. I'm really stoked about this. Ran it this morning. It's awesome. Also, too, Zoot has updated the support advantage. This is the exact same shoe as the Energy, but all they've done is they've added medial posting for those support individuals, uh, those overpronators. It's a nice, nice change. Nice update, I mean. Uh, well, moving on to the Saucony line, keeping that light trend going, we have the Tangent 4. It has a nice breathable upper. It uses Hydrator to transfer moisture in a collar lining. And they also use the SRC, or the Super Rebound Compound, in the forefoot and the heel. Provides a nice, smooth heel-toe transition. Well, moving on to the Guide 3 from Saucony. Um, it's a bit heavier than its predecessor, but what they've done is they've added more uh, SRC in the forefoot and the heel. The result is more cushioning. It's a better fit. I'm telling you, the weight trade-off is worth it. The Guide 3 also comes in silver blue color for those individuals do who need widths. Well, new to the racing game is we have the K-Swiss Cruise. It has a nice lightweight breathable upper mesh, uh, has a nice roomy fit. One thing to note, you may want to go down a half a size in the shoe because it does fit a little large. It offers a touch support for those individuals who need that and it's great for any race distance and it will shed fluid through its drainage ports. K-Swiss Cruise, sure that it cruises you to the finish line. Well, while you're racing, you may carry some energy gels. Well, the Speed Belt Energy Belt can carry six gels. It has a pocket for food and other essentials. We have the Fuel Belt. This is the slim pocket, has a nice big pocket, again, can carry food and other essentials, can hold 10 gels, and on the back side here, it has tabs that you can hold your race number. Color options we have are the pink and the green, good choices. Also too, from Fuel Belt, we have the Ready Race. Again, as you can see on the back side, we have the tabs that you can be able to hold your numbers with, and it will hold 10 gels, no pocket, because you want to go fast. Color options, we got the green, we got the pink, got to have those. Well, for more info on these items, please take a look at the product pages. I'm Trevor with Running Warehouse. We'll see you next time.